and in the land of sunshine and Hollywood, the Earth decided to shake things up a bit. A magnitude 4.1 earthquake recently rattled California's inland empire. With the sun high in the sky and the clock ticking down to 1.49 in the afternoon, the quake struck, centered a mere five and a half miles from the city of Corona. This unexpected visitor sent shockwaves through the inland empire, a region known more for its sunny skies than seismic activity. But despite the surprise, it seemed Mother Nature had decided to keep things relatively light this time around. The quake, while significant in strength, didn't pack enough punch to cause any immediate reports of damage or injuries. Local authorities were quick to respond, with both the Los Angeles Fire Department and the Orange County Fire Authority jumping into action. Firefighters conducted safety surveys across an impressive 407 square miles in Greater LA, ensuring the safety of residents and assessing the situation. While the quake was indeed a surprise, it wasn't quite an anomaly. Earthquakes, as we know, are part and parcel of life in California, a state that sits atop the infamous San Andreas Fault. Yet this particular quake served as a gentle reminder of the state's geological reality, shaking things up in the middle of an otherwise ordinary day. While the quake caused quite a stir, it seems the only thing it managed to break was the afternoon monotony. No reports of damage or injuries have surfaced at this time, but in true California spirit, it seems the Golden State took this shakeup in stride, ready to roll with whatever comes its way. Now let's dive a little deeper into this seismic event. The quake hit at 1.49 p.m., a time when most Californians were probably debating whether to have a late lunch or an early dinner. That's right, folks, an earthquake doesn't wait for your meal plans. This particular quake was a magnitude 4.1 event, a number that might sound small but can still cause quite a shake. It was centered about 5.6 miles from Corona, a city known for its sunny skies and, now, its seismic activity. The depth and epicenter of a quake are crucial in determining its impact. This quake luckily didn't have the depth to cause any major disturbances. Now imagine this. You're enjoying a laid-back afternoon, perhaps with a cold drink in hand, when the ground beneath you starts to wobble. Sounds like a scene from a blockbuster movie, doesn't it? But that's exactly what some locals might have experienced. For some, it might have been a thrilling ride, while for others, it might have been a few seconds of unexpected panic. The earthquake, despite its surprise arrival, was not powerful enough to cause any significant damage. The Los Angeles Fire Department and Orange County Fire Authority, both known for their swift action, reported no structural damage or injuries. That's a win for California, wouldn't you say? But let's not forget the true heroes of the day, the brave avocado toasts that bore the brunt of the quake. Yes, you heard it right, in the midst of this seismic event, some Californians might have faced the tragedy of a dropped avocado toast. A moment of silence for the fallen, please. While the quake may have caused some to drop their avocado toast, there were thankfully no reports of any serious damage or injuries. As is common in California, the local fire departments sprang into action, conducting safety surveys across 407 square miles in greater LA. The moment the earth began its impromptu dance routine, the Los Angeles Fire Department and the Orange County Fire Authority were on the move. Their mission? to ensure the safety of the people and the integrity of their homes, offices, and beloved burger joints. Now, imagine the scene, if you will. Our brave firefighters, undeterred by the ground's sudden decision to play a game of tag, ventured forth into the heart of the quake. Their swift action and dedication to public safety were nothing short of inspiring. From Corona to downtown Los Angeles, no stone was left unturned, no building unchecked. In the face of nature's unpredictability, these professionals proved once again that they are the bedrock of Californian resilience. Their response was immediate, their actions decisive. It was as if Mother Nature herself had sounded an alarm and the firefighters had responded with a resounding, not on our watch. But what's that I hear? The sweet sound of relief. Reports came in, one after the other, confirming no structural damage or injuries. The quake may have rattled a few nerves, but it didn't rattle our stalwart firefighters. In the end, it was business as usual in sunny California. An earthquake? Pfft, just another day in the Golden State. The firefighters, true to their Californian spirit, didn't let a little earth-shaking interrupt their duty. The all-clear was given, allowing locals to return to their daily routines. So, what can we take away from this seismic event? For starters, Californians are no strangers to the Earth's occasional need to shake things up. They've got a remarkable resilience, an attitude that's as unshakable as their state is shakable. 
They're the kind of folks who, when the ground starts to rumble, just take a deep breath, hold on to their avocado toast, and ride it out. This recent quake, a modest 4.1 on the Richter scale, is a reminder that living in the Golden State comes with its own unique set of challenges. But it's also an opportunity to appreciate the impressive systems in place to handle these events. From rapid response teams to comprehensive safety surveys, the state's preparedness is a testament to its spirit of endurance. And let's not forget the humor that Californians bring to these situations. You can almost hear the collective sigh of relief when the shaking stops, followed by a chuckle and a quip about how their avocado toast didn't even have time to fall off the table. It's this blend of resilience and humor that makes Californians truly unique. In the end, it's important to remember that these seismic events, while unsettling, are part of the natural rhythm of our planet. They serve as a reminder of the power of nature and the importance of being prepared. So, here's to the Californians who face each quake with a shrug, a smile, and a steadfast determination to keep their avocado toast upright. While the quake may have rattled some nerves, the only true casualty was perhaps a few pieces of fallen avocado toast. Stay tuned for more updates from the ever-shaking Golden State.